It's basketball playoffs time in the Great Northwest Athletic Conference as the GNAC Men's and Women's Basketball Tournament will tip off tomorrow at the Alaska Airlines Center here in Anchorage. And among the games tomorrow will be Seattle Pacific taking on Simon Fraser University. And Sophie Swant from the clan is joining us now on uh, GNAC.TV. And I guess, Sophie, the, the first question I have to ask you is, at one point, the clan seemed to struggle just a little bit, but towards the tail end of the season, this squad really started to come together, had a little bit of a winning streak at the end to get you into the postseason. How is the team at the tail end of the year different from the team that was basically a group of new players at the beginning of the season? Um, well, we've spent, from the beginning to the end of the season, it's four or five months of just playing together, bonding. A lot of people kind of counted us out because we were eight players, seven players, sometimes even six players. But I do think it allowed increased bonding on and off the floor, and that shows in how we play. Our fluidity has come. Our just straight motion offense looks better. We know what the other person wants to do more. Um, so today we're playing as a unified group, whereas at the beginning of the year it was like a bunch of individuals who were quite skilled individually but had no idea how to play with one another. Well, and you said something before we began this interview that the team at the end of the year, as compared to the team at the beginning of the year, quite a big change. If those two teams played each other, they were able to do that. The team at the end of the year would win and probably handily? Oh, it wouldn't even. It would be like a university team playing a high school team. We'd win by like 45 points, 50 points for sure. How much do you credit to your head coach, Bruce Langford? He, he's a veteran. He's a, he's a calm demeanor on the bench there. How much has he been responsible for helping to pull this team together? Oh, uh, a great deal. I mean, you look at his coaching history, and he's had team after team that have come together in their first year, second year, third year, fourth year, and have had that time to grow together. And as a result, each year have been like a dominant force in whatever league they're playing in. And he, this year, coming into this year, we have basically eight new players, never really played together. And he didn't count us out. He didn't think, oh, well, this is a rebuilding year. We don't really use that term. It's just this is another year, another challenge. How are we going to face it? How are we going to tackle it? And I think that he's given us the opportunity to and the positivity and the areas for growth that we needed in order to succeed this year. And Seattle Pacific University is going to be the challenge for Simon Frazier tomorrow in quarterfinal play here at the GNAC Men's and Women's Basketball Tournament in Alaska. Sophie, thanks for joining us. We'll have that action for you on GNAC TV. And thanks for joining us. I'm Rob Lowry from the Alaska Airlines Center for GNAC.TV.